For those who are not aware, Twitter was hacked yesterday. And today we'll not just be talking about the hack, but we'll be looking at what it means for you. If you enjoy mobile-related content like this one, please subscribe to the channel so you won't miss out on all the pro tips that I'll be dropping in subsequent videos. Let's jump right in. So like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, Twitter was hacked yesterday. And accounts of people like Bill Gates, Joe Biden, Elon Musk, and so many other very outstanding individuals' accounts were hacked on Twitter yesterday. And it got me thinking, if you browse through the channel, you see so many online safety and online security related videos, which means we are doing the right thing here, talking about how people can stay safe on the internet. Because the internet is a very interesting place. Anything can happen at any time. So what does this hack really mean to you? As an internet user, I feel that the safety and security of your data to a very large extent depends on you. Because you have to make sure that uh, you protect your account with a very strong password and where it is supported, you enable two-factor authentication. And whatever security measures that you can put in place to ensure that your, your account is safe. This is necessary to talk about mainly because there are two ways an account can be hacked. It can either be hacked from your end as a user, or it can be hacked from the server end. You know, um, because of course every company has employees. And in the case of Twitter, it was an issue that uh, had to do allegedly with an employee. So your prayer should be, if your account ever gets hacked, it should not be as a result of your own carelessness. Rather, it should be from the side of the company. And of course, if there is a hack that comes from the end of the company, the company will take responsibility and make sure that they restore your account to what it was before it got hacked. But if it's it is hacked from your own end as a result of your carelessness with your password, your carelessness with your two-factor authentication, etc. It will be a little bit of a challenge for you to be able to restore your account, except you seek help from professionals, I believe. What this really means for you is that you should try as much as possible to keep your account's credentials safe and secure, because you do not know who would be interested in taking over the community that you are managing. So many people forget that their social media account is more or less building a community, a community that is being built around their own personality. So let's look at another angle to this. Assuming you own a Facebook page, or you are a website developer, or you are an app developer, what does this Twitter hack really mean to all of us? As a software developer myself, I feel a lot of responsibility having seen what has happened to Twitter. I feel that this should be an eye-opener to every app developer, to every website manager, and every platform manager, because it is very easy for you to just get in the flow of your daily activities and you forget about the security of the platform that you are managing. If you've managed a platform for a long time, it becomes part of your daily life, so you don't really care so much and it becomes easy for you to sleep in terms of your security routine. Because like I gathered from the internet, this hack that was orchestrated yesterday was as a result of the hackers laying hands on the administrative tools, allegedly of course, laying hands on the administrative tools that are used by Twitter employees to manage these accounts. So having laid hands on the administrative tools that is used by Twitter employees, it made it easy for them to do whatever they like to whoever's account that they so wish. And that is actually a nightmare for any platform manager. Your administrative tools to fall into the hands of unauthorized people. So this is actually an eye-opener for all of us, both as social media users, both as platform managers, as uh, app developers, and website developers. That we need to do better, we need to keep our security as close to our heart as possible. If you enjoyed this video, if this video gave you any form of encouragement or motivation to take your account security more seriously, please smash the like button and subscribe to the channel, and we will see you in the next video.